The occasion might be to celebrate the 108th edition of the Nigerian Baptist Annual Convention and the retirement of the President of the Christian Association of Nigeria. But the presence of political figures like a former president and two governors heightens expectations that comments of national importance will be made. The speeches are geared at maintaining peace in the country. This, as the governor of Oyo State, Shei Makide, puts it, is the charge placed on the leaders by the people. This is indeed a trying period for us as a country. There's restlessness all over the place. We also have economic difficulties. We're faced with economic challenges. But as your government and your representative, we will not be deterred. Living together in peace and unity is the only way the nation can survive. And the Ogun State Governor, Dakwa Biodum, calls on Nigerians to shun all forms of violence. Most importantly, we must reject the violence. We must reject the violence. We must reject the violence. We must pursue peace with one another. We must pursue peace with one another. Former President Ulisha Gombasinger's comment is short but reassuring. I am an incurable optimist about the number of things, but particularly about Nigeria. In the face of challenges, positive conversation and proclamations about the nation may be useful in changing the mindset of negativity in the country.